Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. Saving himself for the show, right? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the cabaret at Germano's. Happy holidays. We hope your holidays are happy and healthy. Yeah. It's my great pleasure to welcome back to our stage, and I believe her, her last show of 2019, the wonderful Miss Mariah Bonner. I just want to say thank you to Sid because I started here in this room one year ago today, actually, and uh, it has been so wonderful performing here. This is my absolute favorite place to perform, and it's my pleasure to perform for all of you. I've never It's you forevermore. I've never been in love before. I thought my heart was safe. I thought I knew the score. But this is one that's all too. Set 
enough to win again. I'm taking a chance on love. Here I slip again. About to take that tip again. But I got my grip again. I'm taking a chance on love. Here I prove again that I can make life move again. I got my groove again. I'm taking a chance on love. I walk around with a horseshoe, and boy, is it heavy. In clover, I lie. But, Brother Rabbit, of course, you better kiss your foot goodbye. Here I stand again. I'm riding for a fall again. I'm gonna give my all again. I'm taking a chance on love. Taking a chance on love. Speaking of taking a chance on love, I know two people in the audience who have a very special occasion that they're celebrating. Whoa. Yes, I'm on to you two in the corner there. <laughs> and Beatrice is French, so she chose a very good evening to join me for a cabaret when I'm singing songs for lovers, but friends and family too, so I see many of you have your friends and family as well. Um, but I'd like to dedicate this song to you too because I hear you're celebrating 20 years of marriage. Oh, I think we should all applaud you too. this song to you. It is called In Al Amour, or Hymn to Love, Ode to Love, and it was written by Edith Piaf with oh. music. Well, she wrote the lyrics, and Marguerite Monod wrote the music. And uh, Edith Piaf, I'm sure you've all heard of, uh, was a great French artist. She wrote this following the death of the great love of her life, who was a boxer called Marcel Cerdon and he was flying to see her, and he was killed in this plane crash, and she wrote this, and uh, I love it, because it is not a song of sadness and desperation that you might think. Actually, it's a song of hope, and she says in the end, I do believe that we are all reunited with those we love in le ciel, in the sky. Oh. Mm. Le ciel bleu sur nous peut s'écouler. Mais la terre peut bien s'effondrer.
songbook and um, this one in particular uh, moved me for this one line. <laughs>
you something, which is that you have on your tables little cards that say name, email, how did you hear about the show, etc. And um, now you might have to pass around pens because there were very few pens and many people. So the point to this is, and don't feel obligated to do this at all, the only reason I would suggest it is that you have the opportunity to win tonight a bottle of... Bubbles. Bubbles. Ooh. And two tickets to a show of yours truly in 2020. Now this is fun and exciting because you're wondering, what's this doing here? It's here because I intend to do a country western show next year, and it will feature only country music. So you will put your names into this hat, and we will do a raffle at the break, if you would like. So that's what's behind all of that. Um, this next song is um, a song by Stephen Schwartz, and I was drawn to this because I love the message behind it. I love the message behind all my songs. I feel like they're all my friends. But this one in particular is about friendship. And um, the message is one that I happen to believe in, which is that people come into our lives at certain times to teach us something if we are open to it, if we're willing. And it may not seem so simple and obvious at the time, but later we can often look back and think, oh, gosh, there was something to that. So what what? Living proof. Living proof, yes. <laughs> That's true. I've heard it said that people come into our lives for a reason.
Um, now, uh, moving, moving swiftly along, Christmas, I recently learned, is not just about joy and happiness. I heard of such a thing recently as a Christmas nail. Yes, this is a very hard device, a nail, as a matter of fact, that can be hung on a person's Christmas tree as a reminder that Christmas is not all about joy and happiness. Now that stuck with me, and um, while I find it slightly unsettling, I, I do understand this, and so I would like to sing a Christmas song this evening, and it goes like this. I'll have a blue Christmas without you. I'll be so Let's get back to the serious stuff, shall we? <laughs> this is a song by Gilbert Beco, and it is my great pleasure to share it with you this evening. It is called Et Maintenant, and What Now? Thank you, Marcus. Thank you. 
nothing left and I have nothing left that's the end of the song <laughs> very French they do not sugarcoat it that's how it is nothing you've left me there's nothing now I like the French I like how raw they are and I love singing these songs I have one more French song for you tonight and that is the big surprise coming later but for now we are going to actually take a little break 